market situation update here we go friday today just before we leave you off to the weekend guys i want to talk about the litecoin it's been quite some time since last time we checked in in fact it's been 15 days so this one's really uh you know screams for attention it also uh it, it also calls for it because we have a an active position going for us on the litecoin uh, we pulled the trigger a couple of days ago when price action was dipping low and it was pulling back hard, right? We knew there was a strong, strong support area here and it was a, it was going to hold. It was going to put up a fight at least and could mark the end of a bit of a technical correction. Uh, if you think about it, if you go back to 10 days ago, let's say 10 days ago, price action began to trade sideways. So that's how price action in the case of the Litecoin here express this technical correction right sometimes a technical correction is just a sideways movement in fact 50 percent of the time maybe even more so here we've had that back and forth exchange three legs easily we can count i like the way price section uh spiked that strong support area we're talking about 60 68 and 61 66 so 66, uh, 60, 68 here represents the short-term cycle. It's more of a local support. Price section bounced off, but it actually stabilized itself above 61, 66. This one belongs to a higher time frame uh, system that represents the medium-term cycle, right? So if the short-term cycle last 10 days trading sideways, the bigger cycle, the medium-term, is going back all the way to july and this also trade seems to be trading sideways let's take a look at the weekly chart so we're talking about this part right starting from late june all the way up all the way down right and then the turnaround and started to march forward as if to build up the third leg because we've had one two and it did and, and it did uh march forward nicely but then came the technical correction, which is the last couple of weeks, in, you know, last week and this week. But here's the interesting part, right? We talked about that 61, 66. Take a look how price sections pulling back off of that level right now as we speak. Right, This week, it's already been trying to drill through, but it seems to be getting rejected, which means that it was coming off as part of a technical correction, but also... It wanted to test, or should I say retest, 6166 from above. It just wanted to check and make sure it turned into a solid support. And by the behavior we see this week, and this pullback looks like it is solid. And that's a good um, observation for us because it supports our bullish conviction. And also, of course, our bullish position that's right now active. For now, we're going to be all eyes are on the short term target. So it's 60, 6665, right? That's, that's really the next significant resistance key level. So we're going to be working with that. But later down the road, what, once price action starts to merge with the higher time frame cycle, we're going to start incorporating the next big resistance level, the, the medium term profit target of 72. Right, so that's where we expect price section to go to, probably even higher than that, maybe 74. Previous highs, I can I can easily mention the previous high from 76. Long term perspective, different story. All right, I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna start talking about the long term perspective, but just say if, uh, just a couple of words. I think it can go all the way up to 95, 25, and we have mentioned that before. But for now, yeah, we're gonna be focusing on what's imminent and try to keep our eyes on the ball so to speak stop loss level 54 as you know a lot of room we gave a lot of room for price action okay it's going to be spiky like it was a couple of days ago right but other than that we expect an upside reversal that's going to take shape uh yeah sooner than later hopefully we'll have we'll, we'll come back to this of course follow up and keep you posted in in a timely manner that's about that for the day, guys, and for the week. Enjoy your weekend. We're going to be back on Monday, same time, same place. Take care.